good morning, Sunday. It's quite windy, so I'll try and keep you out of the wind. We're out digging again, a club dig today, and that's my first find, a spoon handle. Right, so I was just talking to my friend, set off again, <laughs> and I thought, oh, because I've been digging tin cans all morning, and so I just thought, oh, another tin can. It's a nice little silver sixpence. I think it's 1930, so that'll be 50% silver. Woohoo! Just had this little bag seal. It's got a number 34 on that side. It's like the Star of David. Just had this big green penny. I think it might be Queen Victoria, I'm not sure. It's a bit better that. There's the head. There somewhere. The sun just went in. <laughs> I just found a Queen Anne half penny. I have to film it quick before it disintegrates. Can I get it on camera? Trying to hide from the wind and then the shades. Go away, wind. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it. Right, oh, back home. I've got tons of cans and things. I've got rid of all that already. Just little bits here. Bits of lead. I'm not sure what that penny is. It's too crusty. Two of them seals, they've got the Star of David on them, and on the back they've got a number 134 on that one. Is that 81? Spoon handle, got some markings on. I've got so I've got three coins, that's my oldest. You can just see ahead. I got told it was a George the Second. I've not checked it or anything. If that's right, I think that's 1700s. And then I got a silver sixpence. Not had one for a while. It's 1930, so it's not full silver. It's still 50%. That'll do me. I don't. You can just seize it if I move it. You see? The back's gone. Same with that one. It's too crusty. So, that's it for this week. I'll get out digging again next week, see what we can find. Best wishes to my dad, and best wishes to everyone else. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Bye.